Whiskey. A very large Jura. Jura. You know it's a work night. <laughs> I was instructed. Okay. By instruction, I have whiskey. And I am drinking it. <clears throat> so this is going to get better as we go along. There's a new mods thing in the menu. That's really cool. I don't have any. Should we do the daily first? That seems like a good idea. Let's see what my very first Afterbirth Plus daily is going to be. And hopefully we can get to experience a few of the new items and possibly new animal... God, I don't like this already. <laughs> Let me out. Enemy types. I assume I can't kill those until these are dead. Or they don't. Yeah, they'll die at once. <sighs> it's a very scary thing to have a Judas daily first. And there is apparently some weird-ass vortex here that is spawning enemies that spawn enemies. I am already terrified. Temperance. Temperance is not good right now. We only have one HP. No bombs. We should find the item room because the item room may well contain an item of uh, great repute. What are these things though? Oh shit, that was really bad. Use this. Get through the level. No! Oh! Jen didn't see the amazing dodge I just made because she's looking at chat. Okay, fair enough. <clears throat> she's my PA today. <coughs> oh, pardon me. I My throat. I haven't spoken all day. I have nothing to say to anybody. Yeah, troll bomb. Just what I need. I'm going to shoot the poops in the hopes of a red heart. This is what I call gen tactics. <laughs> Noob tactics. We can't go to the I curse like, room, obviously. It's satisfying to pop all the poops. They do satisfyingly pop. There's a lot of fire as well. We are in the burning basement. I'm happy to receive this. Especially with the number of keys we've got. We could go to the shop and also buy uh, a red heart, provided we don't die. On the way... Found the item room. Nearly walked into a red poop. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> They're giving me baddies in item rooms. Greed baddies as well. Half a red heart. Uh, half a spirit heart. That's a new thing too. We did get Pipula duplex, which is not a new item, but I do like it. Uh, I think you have to buy Steam Sale, even though it puts us at three cents, which does allow us to buy the spirit heart. Okay, we're not dead. We have a temperance card. It's midnight. We're wearing shades, and we're going to fight the boss. So the whiskey is going to be consumed uh, basically between cuts. It's like a drinking game, except instead of something happens and you drink, well, it is something happens and you drink. So the thing that happens is you go to the next floor or have to wait for something. For example, uh, maybe we should do it on every boss um, thingy as well. Speed upgrade is nice. We go down to the next floor and we take a swig. <coughs> hey, not that big a swig. <laughs> What's chat saying? Ooh, this is interesting. Do I have to pay for this? No. Very well, I'll just take the relic. Thank you, game. Now we've won. Uh, I see you not, that is probably going to give us a win. With Judas, you know, you start off very strongly, but uh, with very low HP. So as long as you can make it through the parts that kill you, i.e. anything that could ever happen on the first floor or so. Like, now that we've got some spirit hearts already and the relic to just produce them out the literal wazoo i think we're going to be all right on this i think everything's going to be all right everything's going to be okay don't worry be happy also no woman and no cry uh <laughs> sure why not let's play with anti-grav because we haven't done anything silly yet uh judgment we'll just use oh hello you can have that much for now. I would like an HP upgrade now in order to give all my HP to the uh, the judgment there. And we'll get this key for free. Thank you. We found the item room. We did find the shop, but I'm going to need money. I don't like this. What is this thing that has happened? The, the, the vortex that just continually spawns enemies. It doesn't seem very isaac -y. Thank you for the spirit heart. See, this is great. Look, you just leave a trail of tears and they, uh... Suckers just walk into it. It's like Hansel and Gretel with the breadcrumb trail. Bomb, please. Fair enough. Half spirit hearts is interesting. You must attempt to drop all your hand bombs. Never mind. You have to speak up, I can't hear you. I've got headphones on, dear. Kill this. I like being able to just set up a few shots over there and then... I forget that I've done it and I let go and something over there dies and I was about to go and get it. Ooh, that was close. Probably should have used my uh, Book of Belial here to get room done a little bit more quickly, but you know, it's basically done now anyway. I would like something to die near this uh, explode itself maybe in this Tinted Rock. Up. 
I wonder if uh, Tinted Drops can drop half Spirit Hearts, because that's going to be lame as. I don't even think that Spirit Heart came from the Relic. I think that was just free courtesy of the game. Thank you, game. I did skip the boss transition thing. Maybe I was uh, supposed to, uh, you know, take a drink. I didn't. You can't stop me. You don't actually control me. I just like to make you think you do. See, Antigrav is a tears upgrade, which is nice. So you can just put a bunch here. Get hit by the horn anyway. That's fine. And there. Uh, cool. There is an HP upgrade here, and we get HP 2. So what I'm going to do is probably take Dark Bum, even though Mom's Knife is right there. But we do have some interesting tear synergies, so we don't actually want to... Um, like, we don't want to ruin those by taking something kind of boring like Mom's Knife. And also, I'm pretty bad with Mom's Knife. So win-win is if we don't take it. Anything for me? Very nice. Thank you. It's a speed and damage upgrade, which is going to help. How far are we going? We're going to either Isaac or the Lamb. Which means... Yeah. Sorry, either Blue Baby or the Lamb, which means we don't need to try and teleport. We're going all the way. Unfortunately, it means we have to fight the Hush in order to be competitive, because this is the daily. We don't have to be competitive. It's not imperative that we are competitive. But uh, Dark Bum plus the Relic. Oh, yeah, and plus walking into shots. Okay, Dark Bum plus the Relic minus walking into the shots still kind of means that we have already won this. Unless we re-roll or, you know, do something royally stupid. Not too much new stuff has happened yet. But this is our first afterbirth plus run. And it's not even going to... I didn't mean to do that. I facepalmed myself at Jen. <laughs> <laughs> I heard the whoop sound of a charged up item and I went, ooh, use the item. It's probably Guppy's head. Because isn't. That's okay. We're already powerful enough that we basically don't need the Book of Belial, although it does increase our deal with the Devil Chance quite considerably just by having it. Uh, maybe just by using it, I'm not sure. But I did use it, so... It used to be guaranteed. It used to basically be the Goat Head plus damage every so often, but it's not that good anymore. What are you going to be doing? You're gozzing creep all over the ground. That's just gross. No new room types yet, really. Uh, new enemies in existing room types. We have not yet... We haven't found a room that contains so many things we don't know what to do. Liberty cap? Sure, why not? We'll use this on the frail. New bosses would be nice as well. I'm looking forward to seeing those. Just leave some things here and it'll jump at them. Uh, unless the mushroom gets in the way. There we go. I nearly used my card by accident with my fat fingers. Go around. Let go. Leave a pile. <laughs> I don't want to shit in your shoes, mate. Ooh, is that spun already? Incidentally, where's my item tracker? Ooh. Sure. Sweet. Now we've got... that's uh, That hood on the left there used to be a mod. But is now apparently part of the game. Uh, called Missing Hood. Oh, ah, so they called it Found Hood. Nice. So we just lost our deal with it. Oh, right, because we came out. Uh, let's actually find the item room rather than just leaving. So when we came out of the deal with the devil, our deal with the devil chance went to zero, which means it's literally never going to show up again on this floor unless we find the goat head. But that's nice. It means we can see our stats. And it, it kind of spoils it. I've talked about Missing Hood before in the episodes. And this is obviously... Uh, missing hood but built into the game but I like to I think we've played the game long enough that it's not really spoiling stuff anymore to find out what the items literally do because you have some idea of what they do it's damage up is damage up good damage up bad damage up it's nice to know the actual values plus I've been watching Northern Lion play anti-birth which comes with missing hood and it's pretty interesting to know exactly what your deal with the devil chance is not only that, but it has shown me that I've been talking shit for the past several years. Well, for as long as I've been playing this game. Thinking that I know what I'm talking about in terms of whether we're going to get a deal with the devil or not. So you can see our damage is changing. That's because of Liberty. What am I doing here? Liberty Cap is uh, occasionally giving us a damage boost or something similar. Hence all the item values, all the stat values changing. Okay, I'm not a fan of this. What? What though? 
Look, I need to be able to actually hit the baddies, like the, the orbital things. There we go. Orbital things, what I'm talking about. <laughs> Vortex things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Orbital was a really good UT map. Yeah, I'll take this. Shop yeah. contains humbling bundle, which is probably worth more than seven cents over time because it will cause cents to be two cents when they drop. <laughs> Jay says, I've been talking shit. Yeah, that's a long time, Jay. That's a bit rude. <laughs> But there's talking shit, and then there's being wrong. Uh, we could try and find a, night, uh, a secret room, but I'm not going to. And drink! We're not actually going as fast as I would like to. And I'm going to blame... I'm going to blame uh, Antigrav here. What is this mushroom thing even doing here? It died, so I guess it was an enemy. Wondering if it was going to attack me? We should check this. I have a good feeling about it. Guppy's head, please. Uh, okay. I didn't want to do that, because all our pills are shit. Now we need... <laughs> great, so now we have to buy PhD to make that worthwhile. That's interesting. In Afterbirth itself, golden chests were given the ability to spawn all the head items. Whereas before that, I think they just had a separate pool of items. Now they seem to have the ability to spawn shop items, I guess? Plenty of spirit hearts, though. 36% chance deal with the devil. Probably slightly augmented by... Um, look at that. That's just disgusting. Can you just not? Augmented by our book du Bileal. So this is where Nantigrav really comes into its own. Just let them chase you and then <laughs> execute dodges that you will not be able to make in your third run if you continue drinking at this rate. <laughs> Let's fight the boss now. We've got a charge. <laughs> I still am not a huge fan of this particular boss music. This is new to um, Afterbirth. And I remember remarking to Pete when I first watched it. In fact, Pete should be here. Pete, where are you? I don't know. It's going to be... He's going to be sad that he missed it because I'm going to tell him off. And that's going to make him sad. There I remember remarking that I didn't really like this boss uh, music. What you say there? There are eight people watching. That's a lot of people. Yeah. We've got a range up and we've got a range down pill. All these... Um, Double hearts, thanks to Humbling Bumble, are going to feed Dark Bum to quite his own satisfaction. That was just bad. Why am I being so bad? I forgot we got um, Rotten Baby, actually. I'm happy with that. He's helping out by producing all these flies, which means I don't have to do any damage. Uh, sure, we'll take that. Retrovision. Brilliant. Such a remarkably useful pill. Slightly salty that it's not been removed from the game because nobody likes it. This is this seems like a secret room, even though that looks like it should have got it. It isn't very well. How about this? That is. We have dark bum material, dark bum fodder. No, I mean at this point, dark bum, your spirit hearts, while valuable, are probably not going to really go too far. You know, sort of an excess of charity. Wow. Fan of all this. Plenty of consumables, so it's already paid for itself. Uh, you do get a bonus for having a shitload of consumables at the <gasps> end of the run. Which is why we picked up Humbling Bundle, even though it cost us said consumables. Uh, pardon me, that was a single key? I paid good money for Humbling Bundle, and I deserve my double key. Not really seeing much um, Afterbirth Plus content right now. I was assuming that, you know, a, a daily run so close to the release of Afterbirth Plus would be somewhat curated to contain... Uh, a glut of Afterbirth Plus content, but in fact, Edmund and Tyrone hate us and don't want us to have nice things, and therefore there is no nice things. Come on. Our tier... Our rate of 5 is really low. Considering that we got a tiers upgrade with, our, with the uh, oh. anti-gravity there. That was worth doing, even though it took a while. Oh, this is bullshit, though. Fuck this noise. I'm going to use this. Uh, took damage. Didn't mean to. You can probably guess. Stop uh, Stop taking damage, though. You've done it once. We all know how it works. It's not clever. <laughs> Good. Dark Bum, that is for you. This is for me. I mean, opening these chests appears to be extremely lucrative. Because uh, Dark Bum's going to give me a spider. Ooh, even more. Ta-da. Because I'm expecting to get decent payouts out of them. 
Because you can tend to get a decent payout out of a golden chest, even if you don't have Mom's Key, which I would like to buy. I would also like to buy PhD because I was dumb and picked up uh, the bag of pills, little baggie, which is just shit. Unless you've got really good pills, which you don't ever. As a rule, pills suck. Uh, yeah, so do I, because I'm just standing in front of an enemy with a very, very predictable pattern. PhD, please. What is this game, though? Potato peeler, a pound of flesh. Well, <laughs> bought it. Let's find out what it does. I'm assuming I use it on a room with enemies. Uh, hello? Maybe I need... Oh, I don't want that. Never mind. Maybe I need red HP, and I'm probably not going to get red HP, so I'm going to put it back. Oh, well. We can get into the boss trap room, though. All right, fire is now abysmal because I took Eve's mascara. If ever there was a time to re-roll your whole run, this is it. I don't know, actually. If we're going to have enemies that chase us, Eve's mascara is okay. Our damage is great, but our rate of fire is shit. Uh, what can we do to improve our rate of fire? Well, there's trinkets that will do it. Careful there. Not clever, and it's not funny. Just walking into enemies. Or we could get something that means we don't have to fire, like Sack Dagger or something. That would be good. Or one of the new items could just completely win us the run, which is basically in the bag already. Why did I not get hit there? Good question. Is it because I have made a deal with the um, our Lord Edmund? It, maybe. I have been granted immunity from one hit per run. Diplomatic immunity, you understand. Well, that was that floor over. Super secret room is here? No. Oh, it could be bloody anywhere. Yeah, heck it. Heck it, I'm leaving. And drink. I don't think I've got enough whiskey. Would you like some more? <laughs> no. <laughs> sure. We've got plenty of bombs. This oh, is so weird able. seeing what you're currently doing and what is... There's a the... large delay. Yeah. I'm going to use my orbital, which is the only source of damage I have against these things, because they're basically impossible to hit from the back if you have anti-grav. Good. Get hit. No worries. I took Able. I don't really want Able. I'll be quite honest. I don't think we've picked up a single tiers upgrade, uh, a single health upgrade on this run. No, we did. We picked up a health upgrade on the first one and then we sold it to the devil for, you know, material wealth. That was not worth doing, except for the fact that there's points. And what do points mean? The value of your peers. Exactly. I have no peers. Many rooms do not suit anti-gravity in any respect. I don't really know why I picked it up. Except for the fact that the run seemed too easy. And why not make it a challenge since we have no idea what we're going to get because of all the new items that we could get. I do see this. Tinted Rock, thank you for mentioning it. We really need to make boss rush. Ow. Ow. But at this rate, I'm not sure we're going to. What are we on? Necropolis 1? Yeah, it's a very slow run. We need to get a massive press on to make Boss Rush. And Boss Rush is not only valuable from the items side of things, but we need to do it for the points. Oh, it's Iron Bar. It's good damage, but it's not good of the other thing, which is Ray of Fire. I'm going to buy that. Ooh, let's buy this. That's surely a bug. I saw, you saw that card. Go back and check the footage. There was a card in there. Uh, I suspect if I picked it up, it would have become a not card pill. Hmm. I wonder if all runes become pills as well. I don't like the sound of that. I'm trying to kill these impossible to hit flies with this bloody attack fly that does no damage. It's not as easy as you might think. Let's get in here. Sort Loki out. Come on, you bastard. I'll bite your legs off. Stop disappearing. I don't have enough shots for you to... Le Why is our shot speed so low? What is this, though? Midnight snack. It's HP. It's unheard of in this day and age. We've got full HP, so we can't be doing that badly. We don't have long to get through this, and there's no way of getting a... 
teleport card because we can't get any cards at all. I should probably open this. Yeah. I'm feeling like Humbling Bundle has maybe been nerfed because I'm not getting two of everything all the time. Bombs are fine. Abel, please don't shoot troll bombs towards me. I didn't. I didn't invite you to this party so you could be a dick to the host. Do damage with the attack fly because it's the only thing that works. Open sesame. Good. That is a. Oh, we can't afford the time. Oh, I want to leave the boss rush and do that, but we can't. Uber lane. Heck. Help. Rotten flies. Rotten baby flies. Do more work. They are doing fair work. It's just me that's bad. We seem to have got out of the stage where the game was feeling that it was acceptable to give us only half a spirit heart every so often. That has um, has ended, fortunately. Let me into this item room if you would be so kind. Please. <laughs> I can't put enough shots on the screen to actually reliably hit any of the enemies with them. Yeah, you can have this. Oh, you didn't get it. Okay. Antigrav may not have been the best of ideas right now. Especially with Eve's Mascara has also made everything considerably worse. And obviously, if I'd been paying any attention at all, I would not have taken Eve's Mascara. But I wasn't, and I did. What is this, though? It's a cloud. Depression. Brilliant. Well, take your meds. It's a good thing I've got a bottle of bag of pills. Oh, this room... I didn't mean to press the space bar, I meant to press E. We found it. We've done it. We can do this. I don't think we can get our uh, Book of Bilal ready for the mom fight, but we can certainly get it ready for boss rush itself. Ow, though. Excuse me. Ow. What does depression do? Maybe it makes you cry more. It did have a sad face when we picked it up. Oh, they haven't changed mom's patterns, have they? This is hard enough as it was. We watched an anti-birth, and with that brimstone laser that comes out of the uh, eyeballs. Phew. Oh god, we've only got 10 seconds to beat this boss. <laughs> We're not going to do it. We haven't got enough DPS. We really don't have enough DPS, because we can't hit anything. Because our range is shit. Oh, that's really sad. Because I'm in here, and I can't get out. Yeah, too slow. So, uh, to anyone who's watching, and hasn't done the daily yet, don't do two things. Don't pick up anti-grav. Don't pick up Eve's Mascara. In fact, don't pick up Eve's Mascara unless it's the very last item you have to get 1001% because it's just gash. Help. 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 What is this one? It's doing the... I don't... I do not appreciate that. It's an even littler little horn. Maybe it's even hornier. Just let me out. I want to go. <laughs> I don't deserve this treatment. <laughs> Help. I'm trying to use my orbital, but I can't tell it apart from the fly that isn't an orbital. That was just a bad dodge. Every time we get hit, we lose, um, by, by a greed thing, we lose HP. Uh, we lose coins, but we get two back. So that's nice. Ah, I don't want this. You, you waste my time with this crap. I want a tears upgrade, devil man. Well, we're stuck in here. Oh, <sighs> Drink. You're not even looking at chat. What is the point in having a PA if she's not looking at chat? I'm flicking. I'm looking at computer You're board. flicking? That's even worse. On stream as well. It's disgusting. I think I can hit you over rocks. Yeah, try me. Oh, depression's leaving a trail of tears. Like a, a creep. I don't really appreciate the, the angry spiders, to be honest, Dark Bum. I mean, I know it's it's a bit of your uh, bit of your curse is that there's angry spiders in your. I assume you've got a pouch like a wallaby or something, but who knows? Like a little box of tricks, a little trick bag <laughs> stapled to your stomach. Dark bum, I do not know nor wish to know from whence you get these spirit hearts, but it is full of spiders, and you should probably do something about that. Also, take the damage fee. Stand here. Yeah, that was really good. Well done. Oh, the black heart thing has stopped doing the black heart thing. So now it just... Oh, no, that wasn't the black heart thing. That was the negative. Because we never actually take the negative, so we don't know what it does. 
We do know what it does. We're just not really accustomed to it. I can't hit anything. Except myself. Good dodge. Seriously? My shot speed's so low, but by the time these things have seen me and shot me and disappeared, my shot's like just taken off. We're going to leave shots all over the ground and see what happens. I managed to get it with my orbital uh, somehow. Well, that's our new trick. Orbital damage for the ages. Where the hell is it? It doesn't even fit on the bloody screen. Dude, bro. Did I get it? I get it by accident. Alright, cool. I will accept this as a necessary evil. Since we can take a shitload of pills with us, we might as well find out what we've got. A lemon party I do want. I also want probably bomb speed. Tears down I do not want. Telepills. We could have done with that on the last floor, but you know. It's a bit a little bit too little too late if I'm being honest game. And also, where's all the cool new stuff? I want that. I want that. We'll take lemon party, I can't be arsed going back for the other pills because I'm lazy and I don't have to. And that was an excellent bomb in every respect. That bomb, that's for you. All the money in the world. Would be nice if we could get something where money was valuable, e.g. money equals power. In fact, when I say e.g. money equals power, I mean I want money equals power, and also that was bad, but... <sighs> I'm having trouble giving a shit about my spirit hearts, considering Dark Bum is providing me with more than I'm actually using, as far as I can tell. Especially when these double hearts keep dropping. Let's do this. We have got a battery charge, so why the heck not? Uh, I don't want to use that against you, but I've done it, so there you go. I honestly thought we were going to get Chubb first. Or something similar, but this is a flying enemy, so no doubt Loki. No, there's Chubb there. Chubb, I invited you. Where did that beam of light come from? Depression? It does look like a thundercloud. Maybe that was lightning. Oh, a secret room. I already know where the secret room is. That's no use. What's the point in accidentally finding a secret room when we've already found it? <laughs> Mousy. <laughs> already found it, Mousy. <laughs> Orbital for everything. Abel, you're doing some good work here. Whoa! New bosses! Two gate-like creatures that leave creep. Okay, I should have probably watched the uh, transition here. I didn't expect a new boss. Uh, excuse me, why is that coming out of you? I mean, these should be easier than they uh, are being, based on the fact we have anti-grab, so we should just be able to leave tears on the ground and have them show up sort of in the enemy's path. They're, they seem to be cooperating, and I'm not sure I'm a fan of that. So we'll, we'll make sure that we don't actually um, skip. Oh, you're very fast. <laughs> Help me. Uh, we want to make sure we don't skip the boss thingies, because... Okay, I'll go over here. I understand. I'll go over here when they do that. I didn't see well enough if there was a tell on that. I wasn't really paying too much attention, but at least we get a little bit more uh, HP, and we just go... Why don't I get a deal with the devil, though? We should not skip the boss transitions in case it's a new boss, is what I'm trying to say. Reroll, please. Uh, Reroll me, not the everything. I would very much have liked to be able to get rid of all the shit that I've done to myself right now. What I'm going to do here is put this bomb here, move this out, do it again. Kick. Open it. We roll that. That worked out really well because Dark Bum has given me great value out of it. it basically makes up for the uh, complete F up that was the previous floor. Well, the boss fight. I mean, it's a brand new boss. I think I did pretty well against it, if I do say so myself. And the luck upgrade does help. That was a plus one luck from just one penny. Oh, God, help. We did it. We're the best. This is why I'm a thousand and one percent, and you're all watching. Oh, shit. Oh, God. <laughs> this is why I don't deserve it. I can't hit it because I don't know where my shots are going to be. All right. Yeah, flies. Do all the work. Dirty work. We need to... Oh, we need that arcade to be an arcade, but it isn't a real arcade. I mean, again, this is a, a room I've seen before, but it just has different spawning type things. I do not like a, a room that is permanent spawning enemies, I'm just saying. Also, that HP has meant that now our Necron are negative. It doesn't actually do any damage to enemies when we get hit. It's a shame. Maybe a secret room. Negative. Maybe a secret room here. We'll find out by doing this. Learned off the... Uh, our god northern lion that you can just 
place the secret room bomb while the room is happening so that you don't have to waste time waiting for the bomb to go off when you finish the room. Yeah, try me, Gertie Jr., if that's your real name. Can't get me past this rock. I don't like anti-grav anymore. <laughs> Can I send it back and get a new one? Maybe this is a secret. I would like for the secret room to border something of value that is going to cost me dearly to otherwise enter. Try here. No! Here then. Look. Right. I mean, it doesn't. But at least I found it. It's a matter of pride now. Because uh, Dark Bum's being so good, I'm just going in. What the jinkies? First of all, what the jinkies? Second of all, what is it? How... So it's a new, ooh, it's a new item. It's a syringe, I guess. Ah, bollocks! Get out. Okay. Well, I mean, it's the same amount of damage, so I don't know why I was being so careful. Euthanasia needle shot. So I'm guessing every now and then I'm gonna have a shot that just is a need. Whoa! Whoa! Wow. I'm down with that. Now I just need brimstone. That would be sweet with brimstone, wouldn't it? So it's a tear that sticks into something and then explodes into more tears. Like a sad bomb tier. Ooh, lemon party is fine. And Dark Bum has got more spirit hearts. Ooh, just one. This feels bossy. Just like... I won't say. Uh, yes, it's over there. I don't need to do this room. But I'm doing it anyway because uh, I'm just that nice. Are these all spawn... Look, bombs. Bombs. I think they're all spawning the same enemies. Ooh, that was a good dodge. Accidentally a good dodge. A good dodge nonetheless. That was creep. Why did no one say, hey, mind the creep? This motherfucker needs to pop up right the hell now. Seriously, though. Are you kidding me? Good. Well, that was my entire opportunity to get to hush, just spent on one fucking enemy. I, I do not think this is a hush valued run, to be honest. And I think if we tried hush on this run, we would be dead uh, on the hush fight rather than what we want to be, which is not dead on the hush fight. Or indeed not dead... And not on the hush fight, if that is what it takes. More! Never before has a boy wanted more. Oh, leave that. Oh. I mean, I guess we could blow these up from here, and then see if we want to go over there to get them. Oh, I kind of do. Let's do it. Dark Bone got me hooked up. It did cost me two spirit hearts, but I did get two spirit hearts. <sighs> Can we beat this fight in no time at all? Uh, I'm going to say no we cannot because of how I uh, stupid and took bad items that wreck my DPS to the point where it is unplayable. So I guess we just leave tears here and hope that they hit mom's heart when they pop off. I'm glad that these enemies have not had their patterns changed because there's nothing that upsets me more than change. Yeah, there goes 30 minutes. We were slightly too slow, and do you know what? We are slow by the amount of time it took me to kill that fucking enemy, so I am pretty much justified in saying that that one bastard cost me the hush fight. On the other hand, I didn't want to go to the hush fight, so we're going to take Sack Dag, and we're going to take the Pact. At least it's a tears upgrade. Hey, look how fast we're firing now. It's almost manageable. We'll go down, and we'll drink more. That's not chat. I flipped. I want to see chat. There you go. You need training. <laughs> Pain-based learning. What's chat saying, though? You have to read it to me. You know I can't read. Uh, who is Strippergram? They have joined us. Huh? Strippergram. Don't know. It's a cool screen name. Welcome. <laughs> Look at that floating syringe. That was just... That was death incarnate right there, and it didn't even have the opportunity to... You know, bring value to our microcosmic world. Fallen, decide what you're doing. <laughs> what are you saying, though? You can't just laugh. I don't. Ah, there we go. I, having a dyslexic person reading the chat. You read it well enough to laugh at it. And then I realised I read it wrong. Oh, is it not funny anymore? What does this do? Pay to win? Dot, dot, dot. Okay. It's a, an enigmatic item, no doubt. It said pay to win. It's a s very Bitcoin-y cent. Not Bitcoin-y, but 8-bit trinket. Like a... 
an old timey arcade machine logo, one that means put money in. Sack bag everything. So I'm guessing our money has something to do with it. We could take karma, but I don't really want it. I'm actually pretty happy with this now that we've got not shit damage. Uh, well, rate of fire mostly. Oh, I still got hit. Did get myself stuck between two rocks, which is what I keep telling you not to do. And in that case, I just couldn't be bothered dodging, so I don't see why I should. So I didn't. Again, with the missiles that are not actually making any huge difference. Oh, I hate these fuckers, though. Oh my god, he's doing it. Oh, he's done it. What a genius. Let's go to the next Beckham. What is that? Why aren't you exploding that thing? These things are easy as well, because you just leave the tears in the way. Oh, no, make more of those. Those are the only enemies that disappear off the side and come back on the same side. All other enemies. I should be using Tammy's head way more, by the way. Boom, there you go. Ooh, Tammy's head can produce the needle shots, which I'm glad I spent the XP on, because it would have been the same XP that got me out of the room in the first place. So it was basically free, even though I fucked it up. Thank you for the spirit heart. I forgot we had the relic, but it's been doing good work for us so far. Maybe a secret room? Maybe a secret room? I has no secret room. Let me out. Don't really need that. Now will be a good time to have bum friend. Because I don't need the money anymore. Nope. I still... It didn't appear to affect our stats when we picked up pay to win. So it's not a direct stat increase based on our money. So what does it do? I don't know. It's a new item, isn't it? That's a, that's a spider dart bum. We've been through this. This is free, so we'll do it. It rerolls everything on the ground, which is quite nice. So we'll take this. Why is that glowing? Well, I took it. What is that now? Whoa. Crowheart. Maybe it what takes damage do? instead of me? I don't know. That's the thing we just got. So I'm going to keep this and see if it does anything. Maybe when we pick up a coin it does something? Let's go... Ah, oh, fuck it. Let's go to the curse room, see if we can get something amazing awesome. I don't really want counterfeit penny, but I've got it. Uh, nope, apparently not. But okie dokie. It only costs us one heart. Yeah, it still does the black heart thing, which is kind of annoying. I do have a little bit of a an disappreciation, as it were, for when the game spends time doing something like that. Especially when it's fucking betrayal, which is why betrayal is a no-take item, as far as I'm concerned. Wow, that worked. Um, it wasn't supposed to, but work it did. Let's use Tammy's head against that phase. Stack these up and then concentrate on dodging. Very good. You can't get me like that, you have to be quicker. Yeah. Bad trip and lemon pie. We do have lemon pie, let's just put this here and end the game. Out. It's not end, of course, because um, we have to do the next floor too. <laughs> but, no. Yeah. Well, hail Satan. Uh, hail Eris. Don't really care about the secret room, so we'll just move on. Nearly there, it's only a 34 minute run. I've never gotten this far. It's slightly too slow for. Either of the challenge rooms that would have given us mad mad points, but never mind. We have power pill is good to know, but we don't. Feels like I'm walking on sunshine. <laughs> walking on sunshine. I wonder what that does. Um, the explodey shot. Oh, hello. There you are. Okay. <laughs> also has anti grab shots, so it produces a little ring of tears that just hang around until we decide that we want to drop the tears that we've got lying around. I do appreciate these things for um, hurting each other with their bombs. Leave me alone. Wow, that did not explode when I wanted it to. Very close indeed. Very close indeed, Master Way. Put this here. There we go. Very good. Ah, uh, yeah. Just get landed upon. No worries. Sometimes you just got to take the damage. Uh, I don't want that. And I'm kind of wondering if I'm going to get away with re-rolling it. Probably not. Okie dokie. Our shot speed is low as heck. Is that anti-grav? Maybe. Let's just use mascara, but I don't... I'm not used to this HUD on the left, so... I don't really have a habit of checking it to see what things do when we pick them up. Here, you can have that. There we go, you're dead. Now we have to figure out how to kill this thing from behind with tears that only go nowhere or forwards very slowly. Oh yeah, like that. Good. Uh, sure. How do you make it do the ring thing? That's the uh, needle shot. 
Yeah, how do you make oh, it this? activate? Yeah. That's Tammy's head. That's what Tammy's head does. Oh. Thank you? No. Wouldn't mind any stat upgrade rather than this shit you keep giving me. I mean, these passives are great. They do actually have a function, but at the same time, all my stats are pretty shit for this stage of the game. Tammy's head is a one-room charge, so you can just press it whenever you want. Eek! What are you looking at, though? Me? Yeah, you. I'm what? Looking at the new... Um, I don't like this. Sky <laughs> what's it? Skyrim. Okay, I'm fighting an enemy. I don't know how to... That's the process. Sky Lake I7, yeah. Uh, can we talk about how those bombs hurt when I touch them? Right, what did you do before that hurt? So this is like little horn but huge. Fair enough. Big horn, I guess. Stop. Th I. <laughs> okay, we've won. <gasps> and breathe. Yeah, we'll take that. It's dangerous as all heck, but whatever. Um, that enemy I've never seen before. <laughs> That's a new one. That enemy I have seen before and know perfectly well not to do what I just did. Uh, yeah, I have no idea how to beat what I'm going to assume is called Big Horn. Little Big Horn? That's a, um, an American Indian name if I've ever heard one. Oh, hello. Thank you for joining me. <laughs> I didn't really want you to. Help, leave me alone. Kill. Help. Oh, God. How do I beat four Mega Fighters with three HP? Less than three HP. One at a time, I guess. Oh, one dead. One dead? Two dead. One hit me. Bad. Uh, this was one until I did really badly on that one boss. And now my HP is so bad that I'm kind of worried about <laughs> success, to be honest. I don't want to... I don't want to win because it's going to be so hard. The lamb is going to be really difficult on this run. We just don't have the shot speed necessity to do it. Necessary. Necessary to do it. Dark Bum has fucking paid out in the most spectacular way at the very last second, and I'm extremely appreciative of that. You died to flies, which also helps a bunch. Okay, good. <gasps> and breathe. Half a spirit heart doesn't hurt. Doesn't hurt. Oh my god, something just zapped that thing. I think depression, if they stand on the thing for long enough, they get zapped. <laughs> See if we can find a super secret room to... Alright, we've got s terribly scary bombs, so don't get near that. Ooh, hello. Don't get near those. We have got troll bombs. Pills. Oh, that bomb didn't explode, and I'm sad. HP. What hurt me? I'm sorry. Guppy's head is fine. Not a guppy transformation. We don't have enough items. What did that say? I'm excited. <laughs> and a deal with the devil. Which gives us nothing of value. Well, at least we found the super secret room. We can't be salty about that. Uh, let's just use bombs here. You dead. You dead now. You dead now. You dead now. This is the boss you never fight because you don't have to. Something is hitting me, and I don't know what it is. Where did that bomb come from? Help. I'm not going to win it. Full health! <gasps> Forgot I had bad trip. It turned into full health because that's what it happens when you've only got one HP left. <gasps> that's what it happens. Look, I'm so terrified right now that I can't actually England speak good. Good, 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 good. We've done it, we've done it, we've done it, we've done it, we've done it. Just don't hit me on the last second. <gasps> Leave. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was really hard. 540. That's not bad for the first time we've seen some of those enemies. That was really good. Uh, cool. That was our first daily run of the year, indeed. Woo! Uh, and of Afterbirth Plus.